I did find some really cool little shortcuts. If you use like Nix Package Manager, I did notice, uh, let's see if it's still in my, yeah. XDG data directories is where it pulls a lot of the actual, like when you look up what programs are installed. I thought that was kind of interesting. A little tidbit here was like Chatterino, uh, GIMP and some other programs in here weren't pulling up because they were installed with Nix package manager on Rocky. And you can see there's a lot of programs I would much rather just pull up through my start menu. So you could sim link these, you could do a lot of different ways to hack around, but really the proper way of doing it is using XDG data directories. And I just learned that and I just put that in my dot profile directory in my home uh, right here, which if we just go profile, you can see the dot profile has that uh, that entry and we could even cat that. And it's just kind of an interesting way of making Nix available everywhere and kind of integrate it directly in the, the operating system. So it is pretty much just like using the actual package manager. So uh, kind of an interesting tidbit I found out offline. I just wanted to share that at the start of the stream before it left my mind. 